documents. Okay, please and thank you. I think there are still some culprits out there, and as I continue scoring assignments, you will definitely hear from me if I need permission. I will probably start making announcements over the uh, intercom pretty soon that will use your full government name, and then a request for you to share and give me permission. How does that sound? Like a deal? All right. All right. Just kidding. Yesterday, the group who came in, I got to talk to them about their opportunity to take PSATs. So if you guys could just stop writing for a second. I just, need, I just need you to give me your attention for just for a few of these announcements. So PSATs are going to be offered um, not this coming Saturday, but next Saturday on the 18th. And there are 75 spots available for students at our school to come actually and take them here at our school. Transportation is provided. Your bus passes will be valid on that day. The test goes from 9 to 12, and you have to be here by 8.30. Um, they don't allow anybody into the testing site after 8.30. It's a very secure environment, so you have to make sure that you're here on time. Um, if you don't know, PSATs are really just a practice for your SATs, and you guys are sophomores, correct? Mm -hmm. yes. So next year, you guys will actually take your SATs, and, the, and you'll have another opportunity to do the practice next year, and the more opportunities you have to do that, the better, right? Because it gives you these great little reports that kind of tell you like where you, what your score was for different sections and where your strengths are, maybe where your weaknesses are, areas that you want to really focus on. Um, they don't go on to your transcript, they don't hurt you, they don't follow you, they're just really for informational purposes and to give you that practice. There are also scholarships that are sometimes associated with PSAT scores. Mm -hmm. If you didn't know that, know that now. Mr. Hilling is shaking his head saying, yeah, people don't know that. Can I just add quickly? Sure. I have a 23-year-old, a 21-year-old, and a 20-year-old, and they're Jeez. all in college. But I think, because we, my wife and I always thought of PSATs as practice, just like you right. said. But there are scholarships tied to it. So yeah, go into it as, OK, this is a practice. But take it seriously, because if you score fairly well on a PSAT, it might open up some scholarship doors for you in college, which is nice, because everybody likes this. You know what I'm saying? Are you taking a video? Yeah. So, do you want to just mention why we're here, or because I feel like are, are some people nervous? I'm nervous because I didn't even know you were here until you spoke. I got scared, honestly. I'm like. You haven't seen me in the school over the past several weeks. No, I've seen you. I just didn't know you were in this room. First day of school. This is totally throwing off you I, I and your lesson, but if, if you want me to mention a little bit about what sure. we're doing. Okay. Let me go over the announcements first, actually. Please do. Let me finish those, and then they can talk with you, and then they can start their watch. All right. So, uh, PSAT, so next Saturday, transportation, 9 to 12, be here before 8.30, um, 75 spots open, and your ticket through the door is just having, this is just an informational sheet that really summarizes the information I just gave you. There's a place for you to have your name, a parent signature with an emergency phone number. It's all you need to bring this in. You can either give it to your counselor, you can give it to either of the counselors, you can give it to me, and I'll personally deliver it for you. Mm. First come, first serve, and I highly, highly encourage you to do that. So, how many of you, yup, let's see him, let's see him, yes.